Hi, my name is Fernando and I'm a technical marketing manager here at GitLab and today I'm going to show you how to migrate from GitLab managed apps to management project templates. Before I get started on the migration, I'm going to show you some of the prerequisites. First of all, under infrastructure, make sure that you have a Kubernetes cluster scoped to this project. So, I have the DevSecOps local fern scoped to the project level. When I click on that, I must also go to advanced settings and make sure that under cluster management project, I have the project that I am using selected. All right, now I can go back to the project and let's get started. Okay, now I'm gonna go into the web IDE and perform the migration. So, First, let's see what we have. So under .gitlab managed apps, we can see that we have a config.yaml, and that's telling us to install Falco. We also have a values.yaml in the Falco directory that's assigning some custom rules. So now let's go ahead and migrate to the template. So what I'm gonna do here is I'm gonna create a new folder called applications. And within that folder, I'm going to create another folder called Falco. And within that folder, I'm going to create a Helm file. So Helm file .yaml. Okay. So within this Helm file, I'm going to add the chart.yaml for Falco. And we can see that the values are pointing towards values.yaml, which we'll create. So values.yaml, let's create that file. And what we're gonna do here is we're gonna move over what we had in our previous values.yaml and move it over to this new directory. Okay. So in order to find this chart, uh, I've added a link in the description, but you can have more information on this within the project templates for cluster management. And it'll include everything that you need to get started. Uh, and you can check that out on the documentation. So now that we have that set up, we're going to have to create a Helm file within the root directory. So let's make a Helm file.yaml. And within this Helm file, we're gonna add some defaults. We're also gonna to point towards the other Helm files that we should enable. So in this particular example, I'm going to add the Falco Helm file that we just created. So here you can see the path points towards applications, Falco and the Helm file.yaml. Now there's one other thing we need to configure, which is in the GitLab CI.yaml. So within this, we're going to remove the manage cluster applications. So we won't be using that anymore. Now I'm going to add the apply job manually. So I'm going to create the apply job. I'm going to have it run on the deploy stage and I'm gonna assign it the cluster applications image. So, the environment I want it on is staging. And I'm going to have it run a script. What this script is going to do is it's going to make sure that the GitLab managed apps namespace exists. And then what we're going to do is we're going to install our applications using the Helm file, which is in our root directory. And with that said, all I need to do now is commit this and let me move myself out of the way. And I'll just go ahead and commit this to the master branch. 
I'll go ahead and press commit. And now our pipeline should be running. So I'll go ahead and speed this up. All right, now after fast forwarding, you can see that the apply job has complete. And we click on it and you can see that Falco has been installed and deployed. So there you have it. That's migrating to the GitLab cluster management template from GitLab Managed Apps.